Hello everyone. Welcome to my tutorial. And today I'm talking about Yarmat view again because my previous Yarmat uh, tutorial there are a lot of problems. I mean, there is a lot of doubt because I received a lot of mail from the brother, a lot of you know, brother. So that's why I'm making the Yarmat view again, Yarmat view tutorial again. So at first you should download the lack environmental software and here has the lack environmental software i open it if you face any difficulties to download this software just send me the mail i will put my mail in the description please check the description if you need and if you uh, subscribe my channel then i will send you the link of the software okay i will help you after that you should open the ear mode view okay So there is a lot of confusion so that's why this maybe this tutorial will be uh, big than before so this is our year mid view uh, the version 8.9.0 for the year mid view you must need some data i mean environmental data two types of data we need for run this software i mean year mid view one is the environmental data i mean met uh, meteorological data and another is our uh, emission data the two types of data we need so i'm talking about how to you download the meteorological data from internet okay so this is the website to download your um, the meteorological data i sent you the link this link you just uh, copy and paste from my uh, description to your Chrome browser or uh, another browser after that you get this type of window and here you can see the weather the little icon the weather just click here and uh, this will go down and click here you can see here by historical weather data and average from the uh, uh, function whatever then you should click here you can see the by historical weather data when you click here uh, you get uh, this type of uh, window here has a map you can see if you uh, just you can maximize this from here and you get the full map here you see you just uh, you just select your location from here you select your location from here okay suppose uh, my location is here for, for example just click here and you get this latitude and longitude after that you just add the location your work is done here when you add these locations you see your your place is this one okay after that here you get the next step you just click here and you choose from here uh, historical forecasting weather data you should click here and you also put the date which date from which date to which date after that it's very uh, like uh, it's not much more uh, the price you will can pay from here and you should uh, put your mail here after that just buy the credit and debit card you can like number one thing and another thing you must need the google earth pro this is the google earth pro okay you, you should download from here i will send this link uh, in my description you just uh, download from here because it's very important to for your research i already downloaded it so you should also download from here it's very easy just uh, click here maybe download I, I don't know maybe my VPN problem mm, maybe my VPN problem whatever when you download the data from this website and you get you get the data like the zip file like this after that you should unzip this file extra okay then the hourly data every hourly you need every hourly data from here and if you get you see 
there's a lot of data which data you need i am telling you in the id locations you don't need date time you need but the another format time no need you just delete it then this is also no need you need the temperature but in degree celsius not in fahrenheit you should delete in the fahrenheit then you need the wind speed in kilometer per hour so that's why no need the uh, wind direction in mile and also you need the wind direction is very important and this is true after that uh, we don't need uh, the weather code we don't need this again don't need it's actually no need then you need the humidity must you need humidity then let's say you don't need the uh, visibility no need pressure is important but mb and it's pressure inches is no need after that you need the cloud cover it's very important no need health index no need dew point no need no need then what is this uh wind chilling no need no need feels like okay you need one two three four five six six parameters that's all otherwise no need now you should make <coughs> a parameters okay here for date type so insert 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 <laughs> at first year then month i will need for here right. insert month then day after that hour this four parameter is very important for run your year met view okay without the four parameters you can't do anything so i just tell you one month and after that you can do by yourself it's very easy not very so 2022 9 i just uh, i just do one month of metro data a lot of the people sent me the message about uh, this problem they can't do this thing and i will send uh, this excel file to you if you send me the mail but i need subscription without subscription i will not give you anything because i am investing time here so let's start you see all our 2021 okay all our 2021 so here is 2022 sorry all our 2022 so that's why you put yearly 2022 it's done okay after that you should check it month so here we see the month is yeah nine months month is nine all are in nine months you can see here nine month is done okay after that it's day you see here day is one so you should put in one where the day is one you see after that after 24 hours day change is 1 to 2 so after uh, after 24 hours the date is 2 after that 3 okay same as other then 4 <laughs> it's very easy I don't know why people are very confused for this leading thing. Then same.
Take some time, but don't worry. You should do this because maybe you are using the software only for research, so research is not an easy thing for everyone. So you should invest your time on it and careful. If you do any mistakes here, your software will not work properly. Not properly, it will not work. So, you should focus on it. Now the last one is our uh, you can start from 0 to 23 or 1 to 24 that's all okay so my suggestion is you start from 1 to 24 better you see after 24 hours it's change okay just copy and paste it's very easy Actually, this software is very powerful software to research, so that's why you should learn it very well. Otherwise, you can't do anything. A lot of things are here, really. You can learn a lot of things from here. You can do a lot of things from here. Now you don't need this uh, column. Okay. After that, you should uh, if you change the location of this uh, column. So first one is must cloud cover. Here have little work. As cloud cover is 2127, you should uh, convert it 100% to 10%. I mean, like you just check this formula, it's 10%. I, I convert 100% to 10%. Okay, because the software only work from 0 to 10% for cloud cover. Okay. I think you understand. Then I copy and paste here. You see, it's okay. Hmm. After that, I oh, can check from here. Here you can see the tools, tools menu bar, 
and after that you can uh, you can see the two file here the first one is file maker and second one is import from excel so we, we import our data from excel so that's why I, we should must click here here you see first is year then month then day hour and in our excel file first is year month day and hour all are okay after that we can see wait a minute uh, after that cloud cover temperature humidity it is cloud, co cloud cover then we should place it in temperature here temp temperature then humidity D C. after that we can see pressure pressure wind direction and wind speed pressure wind direction and wind speed wait a minute Done. Your data is totally done. Now you can put this data in the year. Okay, that's very easy. So this is very important. So that's why I just make one video on this, the data pre-processing. After that, you can uh, you can put your data from here. You see, my data is here. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, there is a little problem in CSV file, so I make it. Uh, the CSV file is not working here, so we should make a excel file the metro data okay i open it then just copy all and paste here save it's done here you can see yes. now the another thing it's also important you see here year and the year is in the a column so we just put a then month is b after that day c our d cloud cover e temperature f then humidity g pressure h then direction i wind direction and kilometer is j so that's why i just pre-process uh, i mean the i just change the locations of the all pull up here so it's very easy for you now so that's all to the video i mean to the tutorial and next tutorial i will show the other thing i mean how to use the year mode and how to select the location of your uh like your target point okay so Thank you, thank you for watching my videos and if you have a little time only one click so please subscribe my channel because I am investing my time here. Mm. So pray for me, thank you, good luck, bye bye.